All right, everybody, we're back here with this girl, and I wanted to, I wanted to make her eyes green. I think that um, the brown color is really pretty, but I wanted to try to do something different. So I'm going to show you guys how I do that. I use a a model called Quinn Image Edit. This is a really big model. Um, so I, I didn't go into detail about this in the last video I made, but this Q4 means it's a quantized version. So um, think of it kind of like it's compressed. Um, Q8 is the largest compressed. Q4 is one of the smallest ones. Because I'm on a 2080, or I'm sorry, a 4080, um, I, when I tried to use a Q8, it got too hot and decided that it didn't want to run it. So I've sort of restarted this and I'm doing it with a Q4. Um, using a four step solar like I did before to try to speed it up. Here's the prompt, uh, change your eye color from brown to a beautiful green color. Don't make it too bright. Um, Quinn in particular likes a lot of detail in the prompt, so you can make this as long as you wanted to. Um, the output, I want it to be 1024 by 1024. There are a lot of other things here that, you know, just constantly remain the same. So there's nothing to really talk about over here. Not for this video. Anyway, it's supposed to be pretty quick. I'm going to come down here and we're going to do what's called end painting. End painting is really just masking out the part that you want to change. So when you, um, when your prompt references it, it kind of knows what you're talking about here. So, uh, so I'm just going to mask out her eyes. It does not have to be perfect at all. You just want it to get kind of close. Make sure you cover everything that you, that you want to change. Uh, save it. And so now when I hit run, um, it should understand that the eyes, or what I just masked, are the things that I want to change. And that's what's in the prompt. So I'm going to hit run. This is probably going to take maybe 10 minutes. Uh, so I'll pause and we'll be back here in just a few minutes. Okay, guys, it finished. And um, that is a little too green. Pretty kind of neat, but uh, it's obviously not what we were shooting for. So I asked ChatGPT to give me a better prompt. And so let's see what we've got here. This looks a lot better. Uh, we're going to go ahead and rerun this with a new prompt. And we'll see what that looks like here in just a second. Okay, it finished running and that looks much better. I think that actually looks almost realistic, still a little too green. So I'll tell you what, we're going to try one more time. Maybe we'll tell it to have some warm undertones or some brown in there. And then uh, I think after we go through one more iteration, it'll be good. Uh, let me tweak that prompt and run it again. And we'll take a look at those results. And we're back, there we go. I think those are perfect. So all in all, um, it took about four minutes to change her eyes from brown to green. Uh, so uh, really not bad at all. And this is my base image that I'm gonna be using going forward. Um, here you can kind of see the before and after. Uh, and this is the base image that I'm gonna use um, going forward for all of the rest of her images. Uh, to create her Laura. And so now that we have green eyes here, uh, we'll have green eyes everywhere. I did want to show you guys just one other thing um, with Quinn image edit. Uh, we can actually do really anything that we want with this. We can change any part of this, this image. So I'm going to go back in here into the mask editor and um, let's just, uh, let's, uh, let's make her have a bikini on. Uh, it should be relatively simple, I think. So we'll come over here and I'm gonna mask out all of her clothes. I wanna leave her hair. Again, it doesn't really have to be perfect. And I think that works. Now I didn't leave her eyes green so her eyes will be brown in this, but this is just for fun. So let's just do something simple and say, change the woman's outfit to a red bikini top. 
Let's just see how good Quinn does with that. We'll give it a minute and I will be right back. So because I didn't mask over the shoulders, it didn't really know to put straps on the shoulders, but you can see here what it did. And I wasn't very careful with my mask, so you can kind of see a little bit of overrun there, uh, but not bad for the first try. You know, we spent maybe 20 seconds um, with that mask and prompt, but you can see here, did a pretty good job of um, coming up with a bikini top for her. So again, I just wanted to show you guys Quinn image edit really fast, did a good job of keeping her hair uh, exactly how we wanted it. Of course, she doesn't have the green eyes because we took that out of the prompt and, and started with the brown eye image. But um, if we were to spend another four or five minutes, we could make that absolutely flawless. So just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, I hope this little mini tutorial helped and uh, please holler at me with questions. Thanks.